Let's start with the new custom button and super preset support for the PT Joy G4. Now, we looked at this in our um, in our pre-show, uh, but essentially we set up the PT Joy G4 here to start and stop auto tracking. So this is a perfect uh, chance to maybe do a demo here. Um, maybe Tess, you could stand up where we were doing the charades. Sure. And John, you can press the button once we have all the, the videos it. set up. And I'm gonna sh let's let's do the demo first, and then I'll show you how how it's all set up. Um, but essentially, we're gonna show the PT Joy G4 here doing auto tracking with Tess. Okay, ready. Put one into my preset. All John's got to do is one click of the button. Click that button. Auto tracking is on. Now um, this is pretty cool. Nothing came onto the screen, by the way. Um, we have this camera set up so that no box goes around tests, no, nothing comes up, it just starts auto tracking. And we have it set up to toggle. So if John clicks that button again, auto tracking will turn off. Now let me show you on my screen how I set that up uh, in the Super Joy here. So, I'm sorry, the PT Joy G4. So this is the PT Joy G4 here. And the PT Joy G4 has the option for setting up a custom button now. So I've went ahead and set up this custom button number five with an HTTP trigger with a toggle. So I've enabled toggle, meaning the first press it does one thing, the second press it does another. And now that I have that set up, um, I just basically entered this HTTP string, which is essentially the command for turning on auto tracking and it immediately happens. So that, that is how you set up the PT Joy G4 for the custom button specifically with auto tracking. Um, so just wanted to show that, but it can do more than just auto tracking. You know, this could start and stop video recording in vMix or our camera management platform. Um, another popular request was to have this joystick button to quickly snap focus. So if you ever lose focus, you click the button, it uh, it does a snap focus. And then another is a super preset. So super preset to just get all your cameras right back to where you want them to be, especially in a house of worship or a space where there's volunteers and people using the cameras and might leave them in an unknown location. You can go ahead and click that button and get all of your cameras back to a known location zone. So.